Welcome back. It all began in a small fabric store in Oakhurst more than 40 years ago. It started off with newbie quilters and now has many experienced quilters in their guild. This is the Sierra Mountains Quilters Association. So here with us now is Bev Gully, SMQA co-president and the Quilt Show featured quilter this year and Constance Peterson, the Quilt Show chair. So tell us first, before we get to the show, tell us first about the association and what you guys do. Do. Well, we one of our major things that we do is education. Right. We, we have speakers once a month at our meetings, and our speakers usually will give a class. And so we have education for our members and also other members of the community if they wish to join us. The other thing that we do that occupies a lot of our time and energy is making things that we give to the community. Oh, yes. For example, in the last 12 months, we've donated 92. <gasps> cuddle quilts, which, which is what we call the quilts that we give to various places. Oh, how cute. 143 pillowcases and more than 150 other items that we've given to organizations such as Valley Children's Hospital, Heinz Hospice, Ryan's Cases for Smiles, and Fresno County Social Services. Wow, and I, so I was telling you guys that I have inherited some, some quilts in my life, and they are they're some of my most treasured possessions. I now love that's them. Wonderful. So I'm sure that people that receive your quilts absolutely love them because you can, you brought some samples, you can really feel the craftsmanship and they, f they feel like they would last many, many, many years. They should with any kind of reasonable care. But you know, if we give a quilt to a child and that child loves that quilt to death, there's nothing better. Yeah, I, then you can make another one. That's mm -hmm. right. So the quilt show in Oakhurst is coming up. What's happening at the quilt show? Constance. Um, well, we're gonna have, members have put their quilts in, entered quilts in, so we're gonna have a, sh have a, uh, a sh Contest. Co yeah, it's gonna be a contest. We're gonna have people who are gonna come and judge it. And oh, so okay. they will get, uh, ribbons oh, for that. Oh, so they can place. They can place. Well, I, I wanted to show off this one. Look how beautiful this is. There is a, uh, so I'm assuming this is Yosemite. Look at the waterfall. It's, it's absolutely gorgeous, and it's a different fabric. It looks like a shimmering waterfall. So I'm assuming that people get really creative with their entries. Yes. Mm -hmm. So there's, you're going to be the featured quilter. That's right, yes. And what, what does that mean? What responsibilities do you have? Well, I have a special display area. There's, there are going to be more than 125 quilts <gasps> entered by our various members. Oh my goodness. But I have a separate display area and I've been given that space to display whatever I want of my work. I've been quilting for more than 25 years at this point and so there's quite a lot of it. And so, so I will have about 50 of my quilts there. What do you like to quilt? Is there, there's different techniques, right? There, there are very a lot of different techniques, and I do some of most of them. Okay. This, everything that's here is a sample of machine work. Oh, okay. And these yes. things, these pieces that are here, are all quilted by machine, piece by machine, quilted by machine. And I have other things that are all handwork. Yes. Yeah, so I, the ones I was telling you about are all hand done. Mm -hmm. One of them is mm -hmm. from scraps, and so all the scraps are the same. Yeah. Tiny, yeah. teeny, tiny little pieces. Yeah. I, would, I would really just love to see them. I, I, know. I hope well, you'll come and yeah. bring them to one of our meetings someday. I know. Someday. We'll have to have you back here so I can show them off. They are, they're gorgeous, like these ones that you're showing off here. So anybody can come to this event, right? Right. Oh, absolutely. For, for adults. And uh, yeah, we, we have uh, raffle baskets that people can uh, buy raffle tickets and we have a, a quilt that's an opportunity quilt that we had about five people make it oh fine most of them were master quilters and yes. the quilt has three different patterns in them each pattern was forty two dollars oh, okay and no one else is going to have a quilt like that because you can't purchase the fabric anymore because fabric only lasts a season then it's gone oh. so this is a one in the t nobody's going to have this is a very unique quilt i mean many of these look like one of a kind they're they're gorgeous for people who are getting into quilting maybe they want to join the association they want to become a master quilter one mm -hmm. day how do you how do you get new members well, the first thing to do really is to just come to one of our meetings. And if you forget what we tell you today, all you have to do is go to Bear Paw Quilts in Elkhurst and Maria or whoever's there will give you the information that you need. But we meet every, the first Thursday of every month okay. at the Elkhurst Community Center. And we absolutely welcome new people, whether they're presently quilting or not. 
Okay. And, and we have circles for people to yeah. come and work with a small group and, and we all help each other learn. Yes, that's always yeah. so helpful so that you mm -hmm. can get help while you're Do doing yes. the craft. So if you get stuck, somebody can come and help you. Well, the quilt show, it's happening this weekend. We will have all the details where it is, how to get there, what times. Thank you all so much for coming here and thank you for showing off your quilts. I'll have to, we'll have to exchange some, some quilting tips one day. Thank you both <laughs> so much. Everybody else, stay right there. Don't change the channel. It's Older American Month and we're celebrating them with special love and care from Senior Care Advocates. Advocates there on after the break. Chair driver hit another.